and welcome to Morning Governor News for Monday, September 20th, 2016. I'm T. Abrams. And I'm Jeremiah Wilson. Everyone, please stand and join us for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Congratulations to our junior varsity boys soccer team for capturing the conference championship trophy this weekend. Our freshman sophomore boys soccer players dominated the tournament and sent other conference school a message about what to expect and more in senior soccer. Excellent work, boys. In more soccer news, more in boys soccer currently ranked 10th in the region continues their quest for varsity conference championship tonight at Hammond High. Kickoff is at 5 p.m. for the last row game on the conference schedule. Spirit Week is this week. The theme is Game Board, Wednesday Senior Citizens Day. Please remember that you must dress appropriately. Would you like to participate in the Homecoming Pep Rally Dance Off or Balloon Pop? We are looking for up to 20 dancers per class and 15 balloon poppers per class. To sign up for more details, please see Ms. Cox, room 126. Mark your calendars for Wednesday, September 21st for our annual Proud of Hope game. Watch the seniors and freshmen take on the junior and sophomores. Kickoff is at 6.30 p.m. Admission is $3. There will also be food court with lots of yummy snacks. Mord's Book Club has its first official meeting today at 325 in the Library Media Center. It's a BYOB. Bring your own book. Meeting. So interested members are invited to bring a book they have enjoyed reading. See Ms. Hilladic in the library for more information. Well and tryouts will be today at 4 p.m. at Plaza Lanes in Highland. Any juniors interested in selling walking tacos during the Powder Puff game on Wednesday, September 21st, please see Miss Miss in room 125. Seniors who are given permission slips during Gov time last week to attend the Urban League Scholarship Fair must submit those as soon as possible. Seniors will have a meeting after 7th and 8th periods today after school in room 247 to discuss the parade and Powder Puff fundraiser. After school tutoring is available every Tuesday and Thursday from 2.30 to 4.30 p.m. in the library starting today. Math, English, and science teachers will be available to offer support with any questions you have with classes or homework. Also, students can use computers to work on Play-Doh or other online assignments. Feel free to stop by the library anytime between 2.30 and 4.30 for whatever help you need. You do not have to stay the entire time. Now here's Mr. Barlow with some red and gray all the way shout outs. Hey guys, let's jump right into it. Uh, to Zion from me, man. Shout outs to you for taking trash that doesn't belong to you during lunch. Uh, you're a real gentleman, man. I really appreciate that. Uh, to Noah Doan from Ms. Broussard, you're always a great example in class. That's awesome, Noah. Uh, to Mrs. Brown from me, thanks for always being available to talk to our students and willing to go the extra mile. Really appreciate that, Mrs. Brown. To Mrs. Halatic from Mrs. Elliott, Thanks for being really helpful in answering my many questions with a smile. Uh, to Ms. Prieto from Ms. Klein, thanks for putting all your effort in your profession. You rock. Uh, to Brittany Sandejas from Mrs. McDermott, uh, she stated that Brittany is a star student and a ravenous reader. It's a pleasure to have her in the class. Hey, just a quick reminder, make sure you turn in those Top Hat tickets. The drawing is tomorrow, Wednesday, uh, September the 21st. And for all you seniors, who have decided what you want to do after high school, make sure you come and find me because we need to get those MHS decision days up. Lunch options today include nacho grande, popcorn chicken and mashed potato bowl, turkey ham and cheese on pretzel bun, spicy chicken wrap, personal pan cheese pizza, chopped salad with turkey, and yogurt box. That's all the news for today. Remember, you can always watch the news straight from the Morton High webpage. Thanks for watching and have a great day.